Hi guys and guys, today's video I'm going to vlog me working on my clothing store for a day. It was really highly requested, so I just said, you know what, I'm just gonna bite the bullet and do it. First things first, I get dressed, obviously, I guess. And then I have a coffee, and then after I do a few things, I have my breakfast. This is the OOTD. To be honest, every day is completely different for me. I have two meetings today, all before two o'clock, thank God. I have to prepare for those, but as of now, I'm editing. How many things was I sitting on? My mom wouldn't let me cut her hair. She's telling Clarissa to do it. I'm actually pissed off. I'd obviously be better at that than, than you would, Clarissa. Oh, so how did I think that? Because you're more. I'm more what, mom? Do you think I'm stylish? <laughs> Give me a pout. Oh, really pretty. Show us that lovely jawline, love. That's really good. The back needs to be shorter. This is how it starts now. It'd be up to your ears now, mom. My sister said if this gets three likes, that she'll cut my mom's ear off. It'll be an accident, though, so it'll be fine. Oh, he's so cute, look. Got to be short now, closer. My sister started painting this room a uh, tomato saucy kind of color. And then my mom decides she absolutely well and truly hates it. So now we're going back to the basically original color. Oh. Clarissa. I'm a That's my puppy. It's about your scratching his face. Oh, that is exactly what he looks like. No, it's not Clarissa. Yeah, it is. That's it's my this. son. He's screaming. It's almost nine o'clock now, and I have to have my breakfast on the go. Yeah. <laughs> test test. I have to get home really quickly then, because I have a meeting. Mm. Let's go. I'm just getting the photos ready for the launch of my third day of the collection, and it is actually, to be honest, extremely hard. Something was very, very funny that I was laughing about. I still need to go to my auntie's house upload my YouTube video, like get my laptop and stuff ready for my meeting, so I am a small bit panicked. I'm just after my meeting. That took way longer than I expected. That meeting went really well. I'm actually delighted about that now. I'm meeting up with Nikki now. I'm really excited because I think we're gonna go to like a small little beach thing. miles left oh my god my feet I'm the most dramatic person ever it was literally like a three mile walk this is it how many miles is this from a <laughs> I'd say it's at least like 12 miles you're so like that <laughs> you're like half of there so I'd say we walked about six miles now wait like I let you put my camera on that <laughs> My dad affected us. Shh. I got a new car, a new whip. I am absolutely knackered. I've been working for the last few hours. Duh. I'm just getting ready for my launch tomorrow. There is literally so much to it, I can't even explain. So 
I'm gonna I'm gonna probably be up for another few hours but to be honest for the first half of today I actually didn't do too much work tomorrow I'm just gonna vlog again and more of what I do I wasn't gonna vlog the meeting you know I can't obviously I pulled off the lashes on this eye because they were pissing me off so badly I'm all my real eye I came off with them so that's ideal and these ones physically won't come off yes, I had the best day ever 346 minutes later so it's almost three o'clock i'm not even finished everything i have to do so i actually physically cannot keep my eyes open for much longer fun fact actually so i listen to podcasts before going to bed and like, i fall asleep to it like, even if sam was over before podcasts it was friends nobody absolutely nobody me in the mirror after a mental breakdown i'm so sleep deprived my video didn't even go up and I was waiting for it to go up at 7 and I was excited for it to go up and I was like, I went on to YouTube and I was like, where is it? Yep. I uploaded it to the wrong YouTube account. But then said if we put the good night. Day two. We sprayed like half a can of dry shampoo on my hair and you can literally see it in my hair because I didn't brush it through. So that's ideal. That's what I want. Hope that happens more often. I, I hope it's happening now. I'm just after a mini mental breakdown so my day has started a small bit later than what I should I have had one meeting today and I do have another and I still have so much to do I actually don't have time for these mental breakdowns like do you know what I mean I've already fulfilled a few of my orders I do have a few more so I can record myself packing them so these are them packed um, I must put the labels on them so they're half fulfilled again. Like, everyone who orders from Kiss My Lips, I have a personalised note because obviously it does mean so much to me. Like I'm literally 19, I'm doing it off of my saving. And then if people order a second time, I'm like, ah, oh, they must have really liked the dress. You know what I mean? It really does just like make my hair go like, oh, it's so green. A bit of a messy morning. What about you? I must upload the photos to Shopify and I must sort out how much my third design will cost. I make a certain amount of profit per each dress. If I'm being completely honest, it's actually not much at all because the dress that I get in are really good quality and they're double layered. That does cost double the price. Obviously, I have to get the quality unbelievable. Everybody at every step of the way is fairly paid. However, I would rather it that way as opposed to having a shitty quality and maybe people not getting paid the right, the right amount that they should be paid. I'd rather my way any day. So basically, if you own a business, you obviously are signed up for taxes and all that. So that means you have to have a turnover sheet. Every time I spend money, it goes in your turnover. I must add two things to my turnover. I have a folder and I have all my receipts and stuff. Oh, we cancel my receipts. You'll have the number, then you have the date, you'll have the supplier, your details, and then the amount, including that. One of them was my sample, another was a domain. Oh, at the back of this one, I'm writing hashtag 30 because it's 30 on that. It just keeps them all organized. 30, 28, 29. I then fold them up and I put them in my folder. Ooh, a lot of people ask about kind of like prices and stuff like that. Like, let me just tell you how expensive a sample is. 126 euro for one sample. The post packaging then will obviously be another what, like 40 euro? Obviously you can get them for way cheaper. I'm not about that life. Me getting triple the amount of profit is not worth it if it's at somebody else's expense. But right now I'm just changing around my website. This does take quite a while. And then if you view it on a computer, I like to have a landscape one as opposed to a portrait one. So you can view here what it looks like on the actual website before you save it. I have a top 10 best sellers list, add up my sales, see which are my best sellers of that week. That's ever since I launched my label collection, it's just basically been my label collection that's been the best selling. So I need to do this fast and furious. They are my top 10 best sellers. So then you can collection list and you can change the pictures. Actually, my favorite part of fulfilling orders is writing the personal note. It makes me feel so blessed that people buy from my website, like that people chose me and my website. It's, it's a really nice feeling, to be honest. Okay, so my camera's actually about to die, so I'm just gonna quickly show you me. Show you the process of me kind of wrapping and finding it. So I have a Kiss My Lips itinerary of merchandise. I have all the boxes numbered and I have them each named and everything so it's really organized. For example, somebody ordered 
in red in size six slash eight this is a six slash eight in my itinerary i have that charlotte red is in box two so then i look at the boxes and it says box two there so that's how i don't have to go rooting through every single box to find one dress before i started my label collection i wasn't happy with the stock that i was getting in at all I'd literally be wasting so much money because i wouldn't be able to sell so much stuff that came in my door and it was absolutely awful and so obviously i had to change that like that wasn't sustainable so that's all the stuff that i wasn't able to sell these are all the samples that i have gotten in for when i was trying out my size guide the material is just so soft and succulent so this dress doesn't need to be steamed i double checked that it's a six slash eight and it is i always double check those things i clearly don't double check everything i fold it up really nicely and then i stick the tag on it so if I have nails on or if I have fresh tan on, then I do always wear gloves. However, I don't have either of those on right now. So then I put the personalized note there. So obviously I can't show you the personalized note because it's personal. And then I come over here to my packaging area. And I use one of these as the inside packaging. I use this as the outer packaging. And then I print off my label with the address. If an item needs to be steamed, I steam it. Then I leave it dry over here. And that is an extremely, extremely, extremely quick process of how Kiss My Lips fulfill orders. I'm expecting that call any minute now. Wish me luck. See ya. My final meeting is done for the day. That meeting was three hours long. I launched my dress, Jasmine, and I am absolutely well and truly delighted. I just, <laughs> it just makes me so happy. It makes me so excited for the future. Much later. Okay, I'm just finished there. I've been here for like an hour. I've just done like, I just basically just scanned a few documents and just kind of stuff like that. It's really boring and it's top secret. So you can't even know about it, not yet. But you'll soon, you'll soon know about it, you'll soon know about it, you'll soon know about it. Video. So here is my O O O O O T D. Oh, it's really bad. Ideas. Hang on, wait. Ooh. So my jeans are top top. My top is pennies. My bra is when Julie left to know. This is Bershka. Pull them bare, and it's so nice. Okay, bye. Oh. Do you like my outfit? Yeah, what? Yeah, I will. Is it pretty? No. You just said it's nice. Play what? Yeah, hang on, I should get down first. Combo girl. Oh, I almost burnt my camera. Jesus, I literally put it through the flame. No. Hugo, you stay. My video uploaded. I literally ran into Andy's house. Like I, I ran in. Like I, I ran in in this cute little outfit. Yes, I ran in. Nah, I was not. I didn't get everything I hoped to get done today and yesterday done. But you know, hey, that's life. Mental breakdowns happen. Maybe for me they happen too often, but they happen to everyone, I guess. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you like these kind of vlogs, or if you like me talking about my business, then please comment down below. Bye. 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 Hey. So you like whatever, just so you can see, oh, there's definitely gonna be the wind thing. Yeah, and then, and then I go, and then, I go. And then she goes. Yeah, 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 yeah.